Hello friends, welcome back to DevOps Seed. In this video, we are going to learn how to build Java Maven using GitHub Actions. So let's start. So firstly, we need to create a repository. So let's go to the GitHub account. So you can see here, oh, this is my GitHub account and here I'm going to create a new repository. So you can see here, oh, new repository, so click on new. So firstly, we need to enter our repository name. So here, I'm going to enter my repository name, Java Maven Project. So you can see here, Java Maven Project is available. Okay. After that, description. So you can see it's optional. If you want to, if you want, uh, if you don't want any description, then you can skip it. So I'm going to skip this description. After that, public or private. So here I'm going to keep my repository public. So, so if you don't want, then you can choose private. Then here I'm going to add a readme file and then I'm going to create my repository. So you can see here, my repository created with the name Java Maven project. So now I'm going to clone my repository. So how to clone? So firstly, we need to copy the HTTP. So click on core and you can see the HTTPS. So copy the HTTPS clone. And after that here, I'm going to use this git bash. So the command is git clone and paste the HTTPS. So you can see it's done. So firstly go to the C drive. So here is C drive, then users, and then HP. And then here, let's check our, uh, sorry, repository name. So my repository name is Java Maven Project here. So you can see here, in my repository only one file did me. So now I'm going to, add two more files here so here i'm going to add two files this src and form.xml so let's copy the files and paste here okay now i'm going to push this code into my repository so how to push so firstly uh, go to your repository. So run the command cd and your repository name. So my repository name is Java Maven Project. And then run the command git init. And then next command is git add and dot. Then we need to commit. So run the command git commit hyphen m and in double code enter any commit so here i'm going to enter my first commit okay now we need to push this code so the command is git push hyphen u origin And then name of your branch. So my branch name is main. And then this enter. So cancel, it's 100% done. So let's check. So go to your repository and now I'm going to refresh my page. So you can see here, we have successfully added this SRC file and form.xml. So let's go to the SRC files. So you can see here, there is two files, main and test. So let's go to the main.
in main you can see there is files app dot java okay and then now go to the form dot xml so you can see here in form dot xml here the form file is used to configure the maven project and it has become been configured to that is known as app.java contains and the main method and that the project should be packaged with these dependencies so you can see here in my form dot file you can see here my app then snapshots and so on you can see the details so this is my form dot xml file and you can see the dependencies so that's my form dot xml file And now, as you know, the readme.md file. That's the default file. Okay. Now, next is build Java Maven project. So now, for that, we need to go to the actions. And now, here you can see some suggested repository. Get started with GitHub actions, build and test. Build, test, and deploy your code. Make code reviews, branch management, and issue tracking work the way you want, and select a workflow to get started. So you can see here the suggested for the repository. So you can choose of them. So here you can see Java with Maven. Build and test a Java project with Apache Maven, and the language is Java. So here I'm going to choose this Java with Maven and click on configure. Now can see your in Java, uh, Java with Maven. You can see your the code. Firstly, name Java CI CI with Maven, and then push the branch is main. Then pull request for branch main because our branch name is main, right? Then after that, job build and runs on Ubuntu latest. If you want to uh, run on an, another operating system, then you can enter here, then steps, actions, then name, setup, JDK 11, then uses action, setup, Java. You can see a Java version 11, this is the latest version. And after that, build with Maven, Maven hyphen B package file form.xml. That's our form.xml file. So that's the workflow of GitHub actions. Now, after that, click on start commit. And here we need to enter commit. So here, default we uh, entered create maven.yml. So here I'm going to click on commit new file. Okay, now you can see a maven.yml file is created. Now go to the actions. Now you can see here the workflow is running. So let's go to the create maven.yml file. That's our commit. Now you can see here the build is running. So let's go to the build. Now you can see here our job is complete. So firstly, Let's go to the setup job. So you can see the details, operating system, virtual environment, runner image, and so on. Then second step is run actions. It's also done, you can see here. Then after that, set up JDK 11. You can see here. Then build with Maven. And see it's also done with with Maven. And then post setup JDK 11. Then the next step is post run action checkout. And the last is complete job. You can see here. Cleaning up or for a process. That means we have 
completed our job build. If I go to the code, you can see here. Yeah. The job is succeed. So that's the workflow. So in this video, we have learned how to build workflow using, sorry, how to build Java Maven using GitHub Action. So you can see that our job is success. So that's the Java Maven process. So thank you for watching our video. I hope you like the video and it's helpful to you. So please like, share and subscribe our DevOps channel.